Welcome back. Get engaged or break up? That's the question uh, on the new Netflix show, The Ultimatum. The show dropped over the weekend and has been trending uh, since. Here's a little bit of it, look. I love you to death, but I just cannot wait any longer. That is why I'm giving this ultimatum. You're here because someone in your relationship has issued an ultimatum. You're not sure you want to marry your current partner. The risk is that they're going to find someone else who is. I think it's natural to wonder what it would be like to be in a different relationship. You'll each choose a new partner. You'll move in together in a trial marriage. And at the end of this experience, you guys will have to choose to marry the person you've arrived here with or to split forever. Gross. The ultimatum is from the same people. You saw that in the trailer there who brought us Love is Blind, and it's hosted by the same people. Uh, when it comes to messy dating shows, there's only... <laughs> There's only one messy person we turn to. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time once again for 42% of America loves Ted. Joining us now from Messy People headquarters is Messy producer Ted Johnson. Good morning, Ted. Good morning. Um, okay, the trailer kind of skimmed over it. How does this work? So we have six couples. And they're all, you know, basically on the edge, on the verge of should we get married or what's going on here? So you've got... Uh, in this case, five women who, who put the ultimatum to their boyfriends and one boyfriend put the ultimatum to his girlfriend. And basically, now these six couples are going to mingle amongst each other and see if someone else is a better match. Are there any gay people in this, Ted? No gay people. No gay people. No okay. gay people. Um, most of the couples, according to this research that you did for me, are in their 20s and that's that's part of the problem with this show so you've uh, there's no older couples uh, so no one with no one with real life experience so you've got a 23 year old who says yes i'm ready for marriage and then a 24 year old who says i i never want children you know so it's in that in that respect it's a little uh, they missed the mark a little bit i would say okay tell me about Alexis and Colby. Okay, so this the show started off pretty tame, pretty classy. And then you've got Alexis who she, so Alexis, uh, she's uh, her boyfriend. She put the ultimatum to her boyfriend. I forget his name, it doesn't matter. So she put the ultimatum to her boyfriend and then she met Colby. And Colby put the ultimatum to his girlfriend. So he's all in on his girlfriend. Anyways, she goes up to Colby and she says, do you think we could, uh, well, you know, see a future together? And he tells her flat out, no. So that's night one. Night two, she needs some clarification. Take a look. I'm super attracted to like you specifically. Your like eyes are like very fierce, but yeah. I was a little taken back with, you know, letting me know off the bat, like, I could never see a future with you. What took you to that place? Yeah, it's, it's a fair question. Yeah. Definitely. Obviously, I'm bad at delivering certain yeah. information, but I'm not attracted to you. His ex and me look the most similar of anyone here, number one. Number two, I'm not unattractive. Number three, that's your reasoning why you don't see a future with me? Lies. No. Uh, I can like see like why he doesn't like like her. <laughs> and he, he was as aggressive the first time as he was the second time. So then after that, she goes up to his girlfriend and goes, you don't want to marry that guy. Oh my, and by the way, hey Ted, guess what? You want a fun fact? Uh-huh. Alexis Colby is Joan Collins' character on Dynasty. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, what happened when, okay, so they paired up. Uh, could you see some new couples forming after they pair up? Like, okay, so they, uh, they, so they all get together for a week. And okay. It's, and it's, you know, let's get to know each other and then we'll figure it out at the, at the end, of, end of the week who we want to couple up with. Well, they're all sitting around for dinner and Nick Lachey and Vanessa Lachey are sitting right there. Now, this is at the end of episode three, folks. So you wanna to get to episode three and all heck breaks loose because people decided 
we don't want to follow the rules anymore. This show went bonkers. I think there's one or two couples that may want to break up in the end. But man, this thing, it was going one way. And you could see on the face of Nick Lachey as the entire season, the show, goes down the tubes right in front of his eyes. Oh, like... Oh, like it makes a turn that sinks the show. It takes a total turn, and the other people are like, wait, what did we come here for? Oh, okay. Are you going to continue watching? Oh, yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah. Oh, you didn't, yeah, he didn't waste a moment. <laughs> There's Ted, everybody. You can watch it on Netflix, The Ultimatum. We're going to take a break. We'll wrap things up right after this. Why don't you like me? Yeah, you're unattractive. I'm not attractive.